Hello, my name is Kush Hemani. I'm a 12th grade student from Mumbai. Today I'm going to talk about my research project. The objective of my research project is to create an airlift pump that draws out water using solar energy. I'm first going to show you a schematic diagram of the circuit. So this is a solar panel. The positive and negative terminals of the solar panel are connected to the charge controller. The function of the charge controller is to block reverse current and prevent the battery from overcharging. The charge controller is then connected to the battery. The battery is connected to an inverter and the function of the inverter is to convert the direct current to alternating current. Finally, the pump is what functions on this alternating current. I'm now going to talk to you about my apparatus. This is a 12 watt solar panel. The positive and negative terminals of the solar panel are connected to the charge controller. As you can see here, there's an indication for the charge, therefore the a charge is being received. The charge controller is then connected to the battery. This is a 12 volt battery. Uh, the battery is then connected to my inverter. This is the inverter. And the inverter is connected to a timer. And the function of the timer is that it will allow me to set a particular date and a duration for my device to function. The timer is then attached to an air pump, which is connected to a 14-inch PVC pipe. This PVC pipe and the air pump together form the airlift pump. I'm now going to turn the indicator on and show you how this device works. So here you can see that the device is working. Uh, the airlift pump is working and it's watering the plant. Airlift pumps work on a simple principle that the density of air mixed with water is less than the density of water. This creates a pressure that forces the water through the pipe. The three major advantages of this device are that it is simple and cost effective. It uses a renewable source of energy that is solar energy and it helps to conserve water. Airlift pumps can be modified for several applications such as drawing out water from wells, draining, draining water during floods, as well as for purification of water. For example, if chlorine or ozone are used instead of air in the airlift pump, then the water can be purified. Yeah. I hope you enjoyed my video. Thank you.